Hello, welcome back to my vlog to his life with Wawa and I've got Miss Michelle Rochelle Baltimore. What are you talking about Michelle? <laughs> because I was thinking of um she used to dance uh, like the Destiny's child. They had a yeah, great yes, way yes, back yes, and so I was like, oh, talking about Michelle, like, you know, like part of that Destiny show. Anyway, so yay! It was like, we we actually talked about so many of the yes. topics that can that can be discussed on Dream in Motion. That's a beautiful name for a nonprofit. It's a nonprofit that teaches, mentors, and uh, actually trains yes. kids from age 5 to 15 to become real. This yes. is not this legit yes. business uh, owners, right? Yes. At a young age of 5. Yes. And of course, you say, what? The age of five? Is that even allowed in the U.S.? Yes, yes it, is. it is. So if you want to know more, you can message us right now. You can message us later if you cannot catch yes. us alive. And now is the time to like really, wow, I'm so excited about this because I love, I love it when something branches out, right? You know, like really moves forward, right? Yes. So the vision of this um, organization, this nonprofit, is to really branch more, branch out more. Yes. And uh, we have a really a very good um, or, um, organizer and leader here. So we're the, we're this uh, dream in motion from here on or what is the vision like well not just a vision but really the movement now yes. like I'd, I'm, I'd rather talk about what's going to happen in the next uh, probably 90 days or like you know where is it going at right now oh this is really good um, we have created or begin to create a network of child entrepreneurs mm -hmm. so they're connecting I think we talked earlier they're connecting in different countries now mm -hmm. we're doing some things in what are countries, countries specific uh, we're going to be in Dubai Oh, Philippines, is. Australia, Sources. Canada, and New Zealand oh. this year. Awesome. <laughs> Were you already, did you already start or you're about to spear? You're going to be anchoring there from now? Which country is going to be first, next? Or uh, the uh, Dubai is first mm -hmm. and then Philippines. Okay. And then. Uh, when is this happening? Uh, Dubai is Dubai is happening in a few weeks. Mm -hmm. and then, so are you going to recruit um, investors or really kids? Uh, no, we, these are kids, mm -hmm. and the kids will go out because I also have other businesses in Dubai. Mm -hmm. The 12 year old is actually doing the housing communities, the tiny house communities in I love that. I mean, if you go to HGTV. Yes. Uh, yeah, I know that you know. In the, I'm a Filipino, and uh, it's really hard there. It's extremely, extremely yes. hard. It can be. Uh, you, it's it's an extreme environment. You know, you can be rich, you can be poor, you can be in the middle. You know, uh, right. lifestyle. But having this kind of nonprofits really would empower more people there. But I bet you, I tell you, I'm proud to say that my country, even those who are the poorest of poor, knows. Um, what ABC is they're very, yes, educated. very educated so it's yeah. really really and there's a lot of driven kids yes but they just don't have the resources, resources. and right. God bless your heart you're there coming there yes you so said you're going to Manila and yes. so on and so forth and there's uh, you know it's like a 7,000 plus plus island so yes yes <laughs> I know. And then there's a lot that are like extreme. There's also a lot of investors there, it's like Chinese and um, all kinds, and even the expats. When I say expats, also the you know coming from America, America Canada, right. or like they, they wanna they, they love that kind of uh, um, culture at the same time that country. So they invest there, you know, and then it's all over. It's it's, it's not just the I mean Koreans, Chinese, everything there in the Philippines. So I, I'm really excited for you. So what's the plan? You you get get kids there too slowly yes you pick out kids. kids yes um, we do have people there you just started already. already from here we have already started they have people who have kids already there oh. so we have a place that how we did you um with. spread the word was it like by word or are you already kind of you know what was the plan you guys know one of them his name is lance he actually runs okay the the, the other show uh -huh. yes yeah. yeah so lance is helping so lance is one. helping um my partner out of dubai also um, is helping so we have a little connection already there mm -hmm. and of course some of our friends are already over there in Dubai you have like uh, someone from the US before you have like an, another uh, my partner uh, who's from London okay is, awesome, is, yeah. is 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 moving our other business to Dubai mm -hmm. so Dubai is really like progressing mm -hmm. like Very dramatically, dramatically. Yeah, yes. like, I and tell they you love, even they the Kardashians go there I know <laughs> they can't wait for our program to and get like, there what they say where the oil is go where, go where the oil is, is. Go Dubai where it is. is where the oil is yes. yeah. so a lot of stuff is in what's Dubai. your vision in terms of like is it more of creating like what's the in like five years from now where do you see dream in motion I want to have almost a, we're still calling it more like a boarding school in one or a few in other countries mm -hmm. because we it's very, very specialized but we also want to have some accessibility 
to go into a place. It won't be a regular school system, but it'll be go in almost like a lab mm -hmm. where you come in and we'll have people from different industries working on different projects that the kids need mm -hmm. to help on. Mm -hmm. So the the mentors actually really not came up mm -hmm. with this one, which mm -hmm. I love. They would like to be able to show up and like give workshops based upon what the kids are. That's doing. what I'm just interested for. Who are your who are your uh, your flock of workers? Who are these people? Are these extraordinarily ex people like ex men? Like have, <laughs> yes, we have ex men. They have, they have like uh, you know they have uh, capacities like not like different but like super human powers to train these kids yes. to become like really filthy rich individuals by the time they reach fifteen. It, you we do are they business some people? Of, they are what type all of, of industries them are business are, people yeah. and they range from all different industries based upon the child mm -hmm. like we do have architect oh. matter of fact one of the architects Richard Luke mm -hmm. who is here who does a lot of the building in the houses at McDonnell Douglas here mm -hmm. in Henderson yeah. mm -hmm. and he's one of them that we get to work with obviously um, a more affluent area here in Las Vegas so mm -hmm. he works also with our young architect yeah so we have some in california they run several businesses um, mm -hmm. one run one runs the expert dojo one runs um another business and of course our partners in london who run the, mm -hmm. their businesses mm -hmm. and they range from real estate to um commodities to um uh luxury uh concierge mm -hmm. you range from um, so these are your social network, like these are the people you deal with in, I, in, in our sit in in Vegas as it is. Right? right. And through Vegas I have different other uh, is, it, is it a good melting pot with. for your business uh, for your organization or is it they're they're more generous or they're more receptive or speculative about this or this here they're they're always open, but Vegas has its own type of way that it likes mm -hmm. likes to, to work. Mm -hmm. So I seem to do better away away yeah, away okay. um we do have a few like i said arnie stock who's really working with us he mm -hmm. worked with the veterans village mm -hmm. and he's we have um have some land now mm -hmm. that we're actually going to build the tiny house community mm -hmm. just to show them that what we're doing that we have to bring communities together mm -hmm. and then you work and live off your land of communities bring it back to simplicity yeah. and so we're taking that blueprint and we're going to mm -hmm. put everywhere we go that's what we're doing so um, how would the community be able to help on this one? Like, I feel like, wait a minute, they're like talking of dollars and investments. <laughs> they might think like, oh, they don't need it. They're a nonprofit. So uh, tell us the reality. What, what, I know. It's not like begging reality. or anything, but hey, this is what we need. You know, it's, it's funny. And I'm glad you say that. Yeah. Even though we are nonprofit, we do work as a business. Okay. Because people there think nonprofit, you're always, you know, you beg for yeah. what you do. That's not what we do, but we always need investments to come in to help mm -hmm. do the things that yes. the kids... Because investment is not only to help Dream in Motion keep going, but it's also investment that goes into the businesses of mm -hmm. the young entrepreneurs. Yeah. So um, those who are flourishing, they have an they have a, um, interest, if, if, if they will, into yeah. a business that's flourishing, especially that's if awesome, it's yeah. a young child. Mm -hmm. So we're, we're, we always take donations or we always call really special donors because mm -hmm. we don't take you just as donors it's like a family and you come in you get to see where your money is going yeah you know because you get to you have events you, like have, you, have, you have activities around vegas that yes. you can get to see you more like not just on the website but just more like more involved with the community yes matter of fact we're getting ready to do what we call feedback we feedback. have a feedback event um and that's coming up uh, we're doing it twice a year mm -hmm. and that's coming up in uh, august actually okay. And that's where the kids get to have a vendor booth. Oh. And everybody gets to come out and invite it. That's good. And you get to test out some of the things and you give is there suggestion boxes and you give your feedback. So you get to, they get to usher in what type of uh, businesses they have yes. and get to know you better. You get to where know would them. this be? Is this like already a set venue this one, or is it on the works for the planning? This one is going to be at the Henderson multi uh, multi generational recreation system uh, mm -hmm. center. And that one is in August, and and are you looking what? Uh, are you have an exact date for that one? Uh, we're, we're getting the date now because we're mm -hmm. we're working on yeah. a few people still we're waiting on um, for that one. It'll be in August though, okay. uh, and also there will be a uh, the fashion show. I do believe is at Galleria Sunset Mall. That's awesome. Uh, with you got a fashion designer. We have a fashion designer, mm -hmm. so she's going to be looking for models, and she's also. Oh, be I can help you with that. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> Not myself. But no, no, no. <laughs> and she'll also be teaching modeling. How old is this kid? She's fourteen. Fourteen and a fashion designer. Yes. I bet you. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> 
I hope she has a vision for voluptuous women oh, like oh, me. Oh, yes, she does. Because <laughs> she has an aunt that she also okay, makes clothes for. I was really for. interested yes. in this. Oh, my God. Yes. I'm really, uh, like, kind of excited to meet the this uh, bio kids. Like, yes. I say, I'm, like, <laughs> super bio yes. kids. Like, like they're really ex-kids. Oh, yes. Oh, my gosh. Yes. Like, who would be even prouder if you have a kid like that or even um. parents? But it, it's, you know, um, and then, uh, well, I'm talking about, let's blend in. Okay. Yes. Oh, wow. I'm just looking at you. Like, actually, I'm listening to her story. It's like, I'm like, the wild thing is like all over my face. I'm like, <laughs> where, 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 where is Rochelle right now at this point? Like, mm-hmm. what, what is that? What, give me that heart. Like, show me, uh, express to me what you're feeling right now. After five years of creating this phenomenal nonprofit, I mean, like, God has shown you, uh, like, you know, years ago what to do. Yes. 